<laughs> Catherine, <laughs> Brittany, Diana. They gonna change this to three drunk holes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. hey. That. <laughs> that, that's the opening credit now. <laughs> What up, world? Welcome back to Three the Hard Way TV. Got the beautiful Brittany Boo Watson. I'm Dion on today's show. We got a question coming in. Y'all got any questions for us? The email as well as the phone number is in the link below. Y'all hit that subscribe button right now. Right now. Did you do it? Good. Um, <laughs> hit that motherfucker thumbs up button. We got a question coming in via email from China Doll. It says, uh, wondering, <laughs> do any of you get tested before one night stands or relationships before you have sex? If it's a one night stand, who's going to the doctor first? Uh, let me just throw it out there, but. <laughs> Is one night stands pre-planned? Right, exactly. <laughs> But make it make sense. Right. <laughs> help me help you. Yeah, man. These dumbass questions. These dumbass answers. You the, 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 the there are so many hidden, I'm just reading it the way it says it. Hidden STD out there. Even skin herpes can be contracted through touch or lying on beds, furniture, etc. Never heard of any of this. But um, <laughs> I hear y'all speak of sex, but condoms only cover so much. You you gave to blood tested now <laughs> now and ass licking carries. I don't know what that is. I guess it's some sort of disease. It's uh H P H L O R I, which goes on heavy. In Atlanta, we're not in Atlanta, we're in Chicago, Chi Town. Right, um, that heavy down. <laughs> we'd love for you to do a show on this. You sent in the question, so of course we're doing the show on this. And you know, of course, okay, um, so this, this is a show. This is this is entertainment. Like, do you really think we just out here just putting yeah, dick, they are dick and frivolous everything? <laughs> Like that. Hey, look. No. Have, have we? Fuck you if it was like that. If, if have we had sex? Yes, of course. Without a condom, of course. Do we know about diseases? Yes, of course. Um, I have. Well, shit. I'm not gonna put my business out there. Like I could just give you the whole paper. Boom. Been tested. I have nothing. You know what I'm saying? Man, so I, 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 I have. I have paperwork. August. I haven't been tested since August, but uh, I'm pretty sure that like the. The couple of chicks that I fuck with is kosher. I shouldn't be tested again until this March coming up or whatever. But <laughs> yeah. it's six months, yeah. Right. Six months, you hear me? Six yeah, we, months we, we, we we responsible people. We talk we talk a lot of shit about raw dog and, and all that other stuff. Yeah. We just we just not out this bitch butt neck and swinging off chandeliers, buddy. This is a show. Put you know get your get your your, your emotions and shit like that in check. We can't advocate and tell you what to do, how to live your sex life, and whatever the case may be. But y'all make it sound so fun, so it's I probably almost feel fun. like it it's is fun. But at the same time, at the same time, we touch millions of people in different places. So when they hear, when they hear that, that's what she's saying. Condoms only cover so much. I mean, you, I've heard people contract. Boils just from sitting on a. It don't a nasty no, it ain't even about that. Know your personnel. Exactly. And How I, you gonna know? And also, How you gonna know? Cause what may look good ain't good for you. And if she in the motherfucking A, it's it a lot of shit that, that look good. It ain't, and it ain't, ain't about good. goddamn and meeting no chick that you ain't you just you ain't never knew before and woo up and it's about. That's a lie. That's what she said. A one night stand. A one yeah, night stand. You don't want that motherfucker. Yeah, it might be a one night stand with a motherfucker that you knew already, and you you still don't know what the fuck they got. Exactly. That ain't hot. And you can be fucking a motherfucker for twenty years, then one day they burned you. Exactly. So it could be a motherfucker that they knew for years, and they just happen to get this motherfucker a chance. And goddamn, when they get this chance, what well, man? They want to know if this person here. Goddamn it. Yeah. Soon as she give you that pussy, your ear fall off the next morning. 
Right, you hear me? You your know what I'm eyebrow, saying? Your eyebrows the club. But y'all got you, y'all got no problem slapping y'all dick in people's mouth. Like, nah, I know. Don't say it like that. Don't say you it don't. Like you don't. We hey, don't, we don't have. Uh, you always uh, talking about the sausage on the grill. Everybody can't suck my dick. Right, some like it's. So what deciphers a bitch from sucking your pleasurable dick? Uh, I I I do shit like. Uh, I give her that test, like I tell her open her mouth, I check her gums. You look like that! He's a fucking liar! I check her gums to see if, no, I'm just bullshit. But look. We, 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 <laughs> it's, it's all about safe sex. You, you, you gotta know, you gotta take care of yourself. You only get, you get one vessel. You know what I'm saying? You're going to live your life. This the same body you're going to live with, hopefully, for 100 years. You know what I'm saying? So, try your best to practice abstinence. That's right. I'll say it right. Abstinence, yeah. And, and, and monogamy. If you are having sex, monogamy is the key to make sure nothing's going on. You know what I'm saying? Just be freaky as you want to be with one motherfucker, maybe two. You know what I'm saying? See, but, see. <laughs> what? What? But it's, it's it's one thing it's for really disrespecting me, bro. No, nah, whatever. Say, okay. <laughs> but it's one thing for her to be monogamous, but the person that she may be monogamous. How's it women do more stuff? cheating. How is it a different standard? No, we cheat better. We don't do no motherfucking. How is it a different standard, though, bro? I can't stick my dick in something and, and like it's a problem. No, we're not, I'm not saying that. It's what I'm stuff. saying no, is that. Just, he's giving the advice for her to either be abstinent or be monogamous. My, however, the monogamous, person monogamous, you got one life to live, baby. But at the same time, if she's only sleeping with him, who's to say he's the only one she's sleeping with? Exactly. So it's it's, it's a never ending hey, cycle. Look. Or hey, 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 look to go a little deeper with your with your email that you sent in. If you really want to go that deep and you want to just really just. Just try to blow your own mind with the shit you sent in. Stop Technically, fucking. you're not supposed to have sex until you get married. Mm -hmm. And then you're only supposed to get Don't married once. So you're only supposed to have Don't sex with one person shit. your entire life. Don't so we're going to go down the list of line of hey, the other things hey, that are wrong. First off, first off, that's it. First off, my nigga didn't agree that's on it. a lot of shit, bro. Don't believe that shit, bro. I, that's, that's how it's supposed to be. Circularly, you're not supposed to. Who says that? The Bible. Who? Who wrote the Bible? King James. Who? <laughs> Who? The, Jesus, the, the, the king. Of, <laughs> God is the king. Okay, God so we're king. not going to tell you. Who the fuck is James? <laughs> we, we're, we're, who the fuck is James, bro? Dude, James can't tell me shit. See, that's just the thing. Can't nobody tell you nothing. No, right. James, you listening to James, bro. You need to listen to yourself and what seems right to yourself. Bro, it's just like from a health standpoint. You can't just be. You just can't have sex with ten people in the month. Just right. from a health standpoint, because yeah. your skin you come in them. contact with these different these other. No, you ain't got contact. nothing, man. You can have sex with whoever the fuck you want to have sex. Not with. if they not clean. Ooh, that's what I just said. Long as they they ain't got nothing. And and, be, and being that's clean, what I said. being clean don't even go back and rewind and say what I just said. Long as you ain't got nothing. And no, I, get, I get what nothing. you say, no, but, you but just, just say, just say, okay. Wait, 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 hold on. You, I'm not saying be a hoe. You, you having sex with this chick, right? Wait, you and she's, and she's not, um, she not keeping her vagina clean. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's, right, that's, that's right. not hard, but you done cracked already. You ain't got no intentions on cracking her again and woo up, man. So that shit over with it now. She's gonna crack 17 more other niggas who what bad. They ain't got nothing either, but she ain't got nothing either, but you know what I'm saying? Everything's still clean, but it, some might transform in between there, but nah man, I'm not sending these people off, bro. I can't I can't do that. You can't do what? Just be with one person? It ain't even about being with one person because one person might not give you what you're looking for. But but you say that's you can't, the same conversation you, you, we just you, heard about the other shit. Bro. You you can't send them off. Send them off as far as what? She said you fucking this one person and they might be fucking with a woo up bam and they and they might have this. You know what I'm saying? Like it might be 
What what do y'all go as far as sexually transmitted diseases? You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm not telling you to fuck everybody, but at the same time, like, I'm not telling you to be cool with this one motherfucker. As long as you got a motherfucker around you, man, that you fucking around with and they doing this for you and woo other bam and they ain't got no sexually transmitted disease. Dude. Keep fucking with that person, man. I'm not. But how can you keep track of multiple people not you, having. You can't, you can't, but at the same time, like, shit, as long as you don't have nothing. In between fucking with them people, like us as men, and we ain't gonna never say this. You feel me? We not gonna never say this, and this is what they ain't gonna wanna hear. We not gonna never say this. We might fuck mo multiple bitches. We might get get up with ten bitches, and, and, and five or six of them we might fuck without a condom. And goddamn it, we up there. We might be still straight at the end of the day, right? But at the same time. God damn it. We know it's not right to fuck these bitches without no condom. And we know it's not right for a chick not to fuck with no nigga without no condom. You know what I'm saying? But just keep doing it. Keep rolling the dice. I ain't gonna say keep rolling the dice, but if the dice ain't got that many, uh, crapped out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You been fucking with this certain select group. You been fucking with the certain select group. And the dice ain't never crapped out and you ain't caught nothing. Ain't nothing wrong with this surf select group, but to the surf select group, goddamn it, get into some who up the band, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not trying to defer nobody to what the fuck they trying to do, bro. Like, I can't do that, bro. Like, I can't. It's it's about living a healthy lifestyle. You you yeah, see, uh, you see hell, what's you, healthy? You see people changing. Bro. People are changing their diets right now, bro. For, for people, what? A, a lot of people for be, what? Because you want to be um stronger. You want to be healthier. You want to have for what? You, what you mean? People got to get up every day and, and go about life. You can get up every day and go about life, and a, a motherfucker my size will beat the shit out of a motherfucker that's got them that been getting their life together and lifting weights for. No, I'm just saying. I get what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, but, lifting but weights, but it's, it's, I'm not. I don't mean like a physical confrontation. It ain't I, about I a mean physical just, confrontation. I'm just saying like. Uh, a motherfucker that get up and lift weights every day, a motherfucker that get up and talk about this and that every day ain't as strong as a motherfucker that already know what the fuck going on in life. It, it, to a certain aspect. But it, I'm saying if you get up every day, you work in a nine to five, your job requires for you to be alert, attentive, and, and to be physical all day. If right. you're not eating right, getting proper sleep and shit like that, that shit gonna affect you at work. Bro, that shit gonna affect you anyway, bro. That's what I'm trying to tell you. No, even, man. Even if, a a even couple if, of times, even if, but even you if, can't live that way even if you all eat the salad, time. Even if you eat salad, goddammit, and goddammit, run, goddammit, 17 miles a day, that shit still gonna <laughs> affect you when you go to work. You still gonna feel like, oh, I don't wanna be here. And we walk <laughs> down. This, this not that, bro. Like, but getting back to the situation at hand, like, man, sweetheart, you can't. Man, life is, you got one life to live. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Hey, motherfucker on this show. You got one life to live, man. You can't deter that shit for what the fuck is going on now, what the fuck is going on. You got one life to live, man. You don't know what the fuck for to happen after this shit, though. You got one life to live. You hear me? I, 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 I can leave out here after doing this show and the motherfucker will blow my brains clean the fuck out. And, uh, and that'll be the end of my motherfucking what's name. So, I got one life to live. Like, I'm not living for what the fuck this is. Man. I, like, I love, like, we all got questions on here, but the comments be super crazy. But in saying that, would you feel like you've, left, you've lived your best life? You were just no matter life. about living my best life. When the motherfucker, when I, if I leave up out of here and the motherfucker blow my brains out, it doesn't matter if I live my best life. You hear me? It right. matters what I did up until now. Hey, look, we we not we not saying uh, just go crazy, be out here fucking. Like he said, if you got your people, you have you sex with. Life to live. Have sex with those people. You know what I'm saying? But but I, my, I can't tell you what to do you by you watching this YouTube show. You know, I'm not. I ain't got no motherfucking degrees and no psychology and no shit like that. Baby. Yeah.
We just in so, baby. So don't take the shit to hard where we say we fucking this one raw, we fucking that one raw. I can't get my dick sucked without a condom. Shit like that. Our personal beliefs are our personal beliefs. The same way he just said what he said. I can't tell him not to think that way. That's his brain. That's his life. That's his dick. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I'm going to think the way and do the things I want to well, do like my way. I'm not trying to die AIDS or herpes or no motherfucking sex to transmit disease. But I'd rather... And then the deal with a lady fucking with me other than a nigga shooting me in my motherfucking head or goddamn it, me getting beat with a stick by a police officer or you know what I'm saying? Shot in the back by one of them motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, like, we got one life to live, man. Let's just get this shit together, man, and live responsibly. You know what you're doing before you do it. You know what I'm saying? And if you, if you feeling at that moment you shouldn't be doing it, don't do it. And, and we we love you for your whatever you do, but don't 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 sugar, don't don't downplay yourself for no situation. You hear me? You bigger than whatever situation you going through, and the nigga don't like you for whatever you going through. Then shit, you bigger than that situation. Shit, uh, shit, it's another nigga out here that's gonna gladly accept whatever the fuck you gonna do to him, and whatever the fuck you got for him, or. Even if he gonna do something for you, you, you bigger than that situation. So, and that's my final, my final what's name on that situation. Like, All right, just stay safe. If you feel if you don't feel like whatever's going on, wrap it up. Don't eat no ass. Don't lick no pussy. Whatever you want to do, man. If you don't feel like you need to eat some pussy with the Reynolds wrap, eat the pussy with the Reynolds wrap. Man, you you, you want <laughs> You 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 want to suck some dick with a kissing man kind of ball? Suck the dick with a kissing man. Every time we come in this motherfucker, too, fans, fans, for real. Every time we come in this motherfucker, Brittany be cooking, Joe, and she don't cook for the motherfucker. Uh, <laughs> she don't you know, cook for the crew. She don't cook for the crew. Like it be some shit she got just going on for the house and shit, bro. I don't know what the fuck you think this is, Brittany. <laughs> Joe, like, if it, <laughs> people smell that shit. Like, if you cooking chicken or scallop potatoes and all that shit, Joe, like, don't, like, like, don't do that, Joe. Like, you cooking for the multitude. Make, make sure it's enough for you. So basically, you just telling them you want to play. I ain't saying I want to play, but I'm just saying, like, like, you know what was going on with what we got here. <laughs> It was going to be shows and shit like that. Right. Man, make six pork chops. <laughs> well, don't make me no motherfucking pork chops. Don't want no pork. With make four of them. <laughs> four pork chops, some scalloped potatoes. He going to eat the potatoes. Yeah. You hear me? And I eat some potatoes and some macaroni. And stir fry. So. And yeah. stir fry and shit like that. But you out here fucking around. And you, and, and you go, well, just wait, Brittany. Just wait till the next show. <laughs> hey, man. We appreciate that question anyway. Y'all got any more questions for us? The email as well as the phone Brittany. numbers below. Brittany went to flip her pork chops over because they was yeah. burning or whatever was going on. Yeah. Really? Thank y'all for she watching. Really? some lemon pepper on there. <laughs> you know what? Y'all some fucking asshole. Hey. Hey, Brittany, we don't play like that. Money power. Shout out to all our fans that love Thank us. We love you too. And Shut our I love you motherfuckers, okay? And I know y'all see the ladies looking good in them three the highway TV shirts. The highway T. Y'all hit that subscribe button for y'all chance to win official 3 to Hallway TV gear. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to make those shirts look as good as the ladies got them looking. Oh, <laughs> shout out to the stylist. Yeah. Yeah.